All right, next victim for my blazing bull infrared cooker, got a piece of salmon. Uh, this salmon actually looks a little tired. It was, um, it was one that we caught in Alaska about a year and a half ago. But I'll try and bring it back to life with some high mountain salmon rub. And I'm going to cook some peppers at the same time in my blazing bowl. So, along with the salmon and the peppers, I've got some butter in the bottom in the little drip pan. Butter, oregano, lemon. And when it's all done, that's going to go over my salmon. The peppers are definitely done. And I think the salmon is probably minutes away. Beautiful roasted peppers. You know, another thing I thought of with the blazing bowl that would be a great application is uh, with sous vide. Because as you know, the sous vide um, doesn't blacken the meat. It doesn't sear the meat. But if you've got a tougher piece of meat, it'll make it really tender. So what would be really cool, uh, I'm going to have to try this next, is do a sous vide. Get the meat up to about 120 degrees and then slap it for a quick sear into the blazing bowl and that'll give it a nice crust on the outside if you happen to have a pellet grill and it's not outfitted with a sear, a sear box on the outside. The better ones have a sear box where you take it from the pellet grill to the sear box and get that crust on the outside. Slap it into the blazing bull and you'll have the same results. Um, it'll get that char on the outside because one of the things that the pellet grills don't do is really sear it on the outside. So my salmon is ready. Oh, <laughs> man, that is perfect. I can tell it's, it's firmed up. And I like my salmon a little on the undercooked side. This, I'm going to see on the inside, is probably, oh, yeah, it's still moist on the inside. It's, it's a little closer to medium. I like it cooked about medium rare, so maybe next time I won't leave it in quite so long. But I'm going to put some of these grilled peppers in here. Little color, a little interest, a little contrast. Now here's my lemon oregano butter. Goes right on the top. I'll even put the lemons in there too. All right, so blazing bowl, searing salmon, searing peppers. Works good.